boys to pick out some nice back-to-school clothes. Wow, that was fast. Well, we do have a signature look. Although Perry's mixing it up a bit. Cute! Okay, here's some quarters for the arcade. I'm gonna see what's keeping your sister. Okay, see you later, Mom. With this many quarters, we can play 72 straight hours of... Hey, check it out! This was my favorite ride when I was little. Better enjoy it while you can, boys. These old fellows are pretty worn out. I'll be back in a little while to haul them away. What a shame. I wonder if they're still as much fun as they used to be. You know, in retrospect, I may have over-romanticized those memories. But I'll bet with a little effort and some unstable uranium isotopes, we can make them that much fun. Ferb, I know where we're gonna... Hey, where's Perry? Oh, I'll get with the beat! You're messing up my score! Uniforms. That's the last one, sir. I mean, seriously, I'm growing mushrooms under here. <laughs> I don't smell too bad, do I? I can't smell a thing. Well, that's a relief. I thought maybe no, I was... No, I can't smell a thing, sir. I have no sense of smell. Really? I was born without nostrils, sir. Oh, I thought you were joking about that on your resume. Uh, Agent D. Uh, just give me a few seconds. And Dr. Doofenshmirtz has been buying up every can of aerosol deodorant in the tri-state area. And I'm starting to smell like a science fiction convention. We need you to find out what he's doing with all those aerosol spray cans and put a stop to it. Good luck, Agent D. Doofenshmirtz walks to the diner. I just called in a to-go order for Doofenshmirtz. Hey, Vic! You got an order from Doofyberg? No, no, no. Doofenshmirtz. Heinz Doofenshmirtz. Surely you've heard of me. Okay, order for Heinz Doofenshmirtz. Is that right? No, Doofenshmirtz. Doofen... My, my brother's the mayor. Roger Doofenshmirtz is your brother? Yes, Doofenshmirtz. And your name is? Heinz Doofenshmirtz. Do we have an order for a Heinz Doofenblatt? Ah, mark my words. You will remember the name of Heinz Doofenshmirtz. <laughs> Could I still get my whole wheat on rye? Sure, what's your name? Oh, God. Hey, Phineas. What you doing? Oh, hey, Isabella. Hey, losers. Oh, hey, guys. Don't tell me you're playing with that lame kitty ride. We tricked it out, and now it's pretty awesome. I'll be the judge of that. Step aside. This better be worth a quarter. Ooh, this is so exciting. Let me catch my breath. What is not to like? It has what every kid loves, rocking back and forth and slowness. May I suggest pressing that red button? Ooh, can I? <laughs> so what do you think? I get it! This is awesome! Ah, Perry the Platypus, how predictable. And by predictable, I mean uh, completely... Predictable, I guess. Uh, anyway. <laughs> oh, don't bother trying to escape. The walls are made of a super slick alloy and treated with a few dozen coats of nonstick cooking spray. I'm sure you've noticed my impressive collection of aerosol spray cans. Every can of aerosol deodorant, hairspray, and bug repellent from the dry state area. All mine. I'm tapping into their ozone depleting propellants to fuel my latest evil scheme. The aerosol propelled ozone depletinator. The citizens of Danville will definitely learn the name of Heinz Doofenshmirtz when I spell it out in the sky in hundred foot tall letters made of atmosphere destroying aerosol gases, thereby depleting the protective ozone layer. And the resulting radiation will burn my name right through town. Then they'll remember. And if they don't, they can just look outside. <laughs> I need a little drink of water after a tirade like that. Ah, <laughs> uh, glostacular lipstick. Now I can blow up a bounce house and my lips would still be shiny. I bet Phineas and Ferb are behind this. Wow, that was fun. I've got you this time. And to make sure this doesn't disappear, I'm going to sit here on the evidence till Mom comes back. This is going to be worth a quarter. <laughs> Hang on, Candace. We're right behind you. Good thing we tricked out the other rides. Come on. Hang on, Candace. We're coming. But if you would just the talk and check the vow progression Well, you'll be advised and realize that the old cliche is true You can't judge a book by the way it looks for truth is up to you Life-checking and high-up in 
to get us an aerial view. Sure, Phineas. Well, what do you know? Nostradamus was right. just literal. Like you made it back in one piece. You guys are gonna be so busted when I show mom what you did to those K rides. Oh, there you are, Perry. All right, one side, kids. We're replacing these old rides with brand new identical ones, with special emphasis on the identical. See ya. Bye now. Well, that was fun. Maybe tomorrow we can soup up our old bikes. Lame. That's what you said about the kitty rides. And I was right. Until I wasn't. Here it is, Mom. I'll show you. If you'll just give me a quarter, please. Aren't you a little old for kitty rides? No, no, I'm not. Check it out. Well, I guess it does have rocking back and forth and slowness. 